as it relates to platforms leaving. And when we had a previous conversation, you talked to me about the power of a podcast really was about owning your content. Can you speak a little bit about how the current environment, you know, when you, if you want to be an influencer or you're working for someone else, what you post on these current platforms, the Twitters, Instagrams, whatever, isn't necessarily under your ownership, but a podcast can be. Can you speak a little bit about exactly what that means and what that looks like? Certainly. So when it when it comes to the platforms that we have access to now, uh, a, a lot of times it, it's almost the equivalent to us renting space, right? Because we're posting on their platform and then they can change the that they can change the guidelines, they can change the standards in the middle of the night or they have the fine print. So what, ultimately what that means is we don't have complete total control. But with a podcast, the, the way a podcast is set up, and I, I'm not going to get too technical, but ultimately, j- just like how we're familiar with like the floppy disk or, or like CDs, stuff like this, we can take our podcast content and then plug it in somewhere else, but where we have complete control no matter what. So we can uh, upload it to this host provider. If we don't like the service that they're giving us, we can pull it off and then go somewhere else and do the same thing. So you have complete control and nobody can take that from you. 